does that mean then if there's uh, extra resources of staff to be able to redeploy to, let's say, the more complex cases, that we're now processing those complex cases quicker? Because in a lot of occasions that I would find some of those complex uh, cases can be for business purposes and have a real and urgent need to them. So if we're getting through them quicker, that's positive as well. Can you also outline uh, what is the uptake on passport cards? Um, and are, are we seeing um, uh, an increase in the take-up of them? And just in relation to the online service, is that proven now to be quicker than um, Passport Express? Um, and if so, obviously it's cheaper. So th to highlight to people, uh, if that is quicker, then um, to be encouraging people to go through that route if possible. Uh, yeah, no, I mean, in some ways, uh, in the current system, uh, Passport Express, if it's described as that, is almost a misnomer mm. uh, because the online application process is far quicker. Uh, there's a 10-day turnaround time, but often people get their passports back in three or four days. Uh, like, it happens really quickly. Um, and, um, but we've set a target of 10 days plus postage, but uh, it's often a lot quicker than that. Uh, and then the, uh, the, the postage process takes 15 days, so it's 50% longer, uh, even though that's still a pretty efficient turnaround time as well. Um, but um, uh, the online system is the most efficient, the safest, the most secure and the fastest. Uh, and we would really encourage people to use the online uh, resource that's there now. Uh, it's pretty easy to use. Uh, and um, the, the old days of filling out forms and sending them off in the post, even though it's, it's still a pretty efficient system, uh, isn't anything uh, as efficient uh, as doing it online. Um, uh, and I think we've got a lot of positive feedback this year from the online system, both for children and for adults. Uh, and we want to continue this step-by-step uh, -step, uh, shift to online. Uh, hopefully, we will have all passport applications online uh, by the end of 2021-2022. Mike, Deputy Thomas Burns, already seconds to introduce. I suppose one of the founding principles of this state